those are lob lollies, but they're stunted, right? Yeah. Well, obviously, a rock outcrop is a difficult place for trees. Trees need a lot more soil than these little yellow daisies or these toe flax. And uh, soil is at a premium here. And I doubt that this plant, this, these lob lolly pines, are making do on the three or four inches at the most that we see. There's almost certainly a crevice there that's covered up by mosses and, and pine needles and other kinds of uh, litter. And so you can't really see, but those roots are getting down deep in a crack in the rock. There's, you can see the, the crack here, something like that is going on there. But they wouldn't be able to get this big on the little soil that you can see. Now, once you get back over into where the woods are deeper and the soil, I mean the woods are thicker and denser and the dog, trees are bigger, you can bet there's a lot more soil than there is right here. These are managing to eke out an existence here, but uh, if this is another drought year, they could be doomed. Maybe the rocks are somehow some degree holding some of the roots uh, over top the roots. The roots have gone under the, some of the rock and thereby helping to keep the plant vertical. That's right. There's not much anchorage there if it was just based on the surface soil, but it's managed to get its roots down into a crevice. And so it's probably well anchored. It has a better source of water than uh, some of these others. But we can certainly see some that haven't made it. There's a dead one over there. It looks like it, or at least it's almost dead. It made a real effort there at the end. There are a lot of pine cones from last year. But uh, that one is probably not going to make it. These, well, the jury is out. It all depends on how much drought as to whether these will be here next year and the year after that.